In this video, we're diving deep into the subtle and not so subtle ways women signal that they're hoping you'll ask them out. From sharing their favorite date spots to hinting at their single status, we'll decode all the clues that she's ready for you to make a move. By the end of this video, you'll be a master at reading between the lines and turning those hints into unforgettable first dates. So sit back, take notes, and get ready to unlock the secrets of the female mind. Trust me, fellas, once you know what to look for, you'll never miss an opportunity to sweep her off her feet again. One, she shares her interests and hobbies with you. All right, gents, let's talk about one of the most common ways a woman signals she's interested in you asking her out. She starts sharing her passions and hobbies with you. Now, this isn't just idle chit chat. When a lady opens up about the things that truly light her fire, she's giving you a VIP pass into her world. Think about it. She's not just telling you what she likes, she's showing you a piece of her soul. Whether it's her love for obscure indie bands or her obsession with rock climbing, she's trusting you with the stuff that makes her tick. It's like she's handing you a roadmap to her heart and saying, hey, I think we might have something special here. So how do you respond when she starts gushing about her favorite hobbies? Easy, you show genuine interest and enthusiasm. Ask her questions, get curious about what makes these things so special to her. Show her that you're not just nodding along to be polite, but that you're truly fascinated by the things that fascinate her. And here's the kicker. Once you've established that shared passion, use it as a springboard to ask her out. Say something like, hey, I'd love to learn more about your favorite hiking trails. Maybe we could go for a trek together sometime. You've taken that common interest and turned it into an opportunity for a date. She'll be thrilled that you're not just listening, but actively looking for ways to incorporate her passions into your time together. Two, she tells you about her favorite restaurants. Listen up, fellas. When a woman starts dishing about her favorite dining spots, she's not just making small talk. She's giving you a golden opportunity to sweep her off her feet and take her on the culinary adventure of her dreams. Think about it. When a lady shares her go-to restaurants with you, she's letting you in on her inner circle of pleasure. She's telling you about the places that make her taste buds sing and her heart skip a beat. It's like she's handing you the keys to her gastronomic kingdom and saying, hey, I think you might be worthy of sharing a meal with me. So how do you respond when she starts waxing poetic about that hole-in-the-wall sushi joint or the cozy Italian bistro that makes the best carbonara in town? Simple. You seize the moment and ask her out on a date. Say something like, Wow, that place sounds amazing. I'd love to check it out with you sometime. How about we make a reservation for next Friday? By taking her restaurant recommendations and turning them into a concrete plan, you're showing her that you're not just a good listener. You're a man of action. You're demonstrating that you value her opinions and want to create special moments together based on the things she loves. And here's the best part. By letting her pick the place, you're giving her a sense of control and investment in the date. She'll feel like she's not just being asked out, but actively collaborating in creating a memorable experience. It's a surefire way to make her feel special and appreciated from the very start. Three, she asks for your opinion on date ideas. Okay, gents, listen up. When a woman starts picking your brain about date ideas, it's not just idle curiosity. It's a flashing neon sign that she's interested in going out with you and wants to gauge your romantic sensibilities. Think about it. When a lady asks for your opinion on the perfect date, she's essentially saying, hey, I'm imagining what it would be like to spend quality time with you. What kind of experiences do you think would bring us closer together? It's like she's handing you a blank canvas and asking you to paint a picture of your potential future together. So how do you respond when she starts fishing for date ideas? Simple, you use it as an opportunity to showcase your creativity and thoughtfulness. Don't just rattle off a generic list of dinner and a movie cliches. Put some real effort into crafting a date that's tailored to her unique interests and personality. Say something like, well, knowing how much you love live music, I think an intimate concert at a cozy venue could be really special. We could grab drinks beforehand and then lose ourselves in the moment, just you and me, or maybe, Given your adventurous spirit, I could see us going on a scenic hike and packing a picnic lunch to enjoy at the summit. We could soak in the views and just talk for hours. By painting a vivid picture of a date that's perfectly suited to her, you're showing her that you've been paying attention to the things that matter to her. You're demonstrating that you're not just interested in going through the motions, but in creating meaningful experiences that will bring you closer together. And here's the kicker. Once you've laid out your dream date scenario, use it as a springboard to actually ask her out. Say something like, you know what? I think we should make that concert idea a reality. What do you say? Want to join me for a night of live music and great company? 
She'll be thrilled that you're not just a creative thinker, but a man of action who's ready to turn those date dreams into reality. Four, she talks about being single or ready to date. When a lady starts dropping hints about her single status or her readiness to date, it's like she's waving a giant flag that says, hey, I'm available and looking for love. Now, this isn't just idle chatter or a casual update on her relationship status. When a woman deliberately brings up her singlehood in conversation with you, she's sending a clear message that she wants you to know she's on the market. It's like she's saying, just so you're aware, I'm not attached to anyone at the moment. Do with that information what you will. So how do you respond when she starts hinting at her romantic availability? Easy. You seize the moment and express your own interest in exploring a connection. Say something like, I've really enjoyed getting to know you these past few weeks. Since you mentioned you're single and ready to date, I'd love to take you out sometime and see where this could go. By acknowledging her hints and making your intentions clear, you're showing her that you're not oblivious to her signals. You're demonstrating that you're a man who pays attention and isn't afraid to go after what he wants. And by framing the date as an opportunity to explore your potential together, you're creating a sense of excitement and possibility that's sure to pique her interest. Just remember, gents, when a woman starts talking about her single status, it's not an invitation to pounce or pressure her. It's simply an opening for you to express your own interest in a respectful and straightforward way. Show her that you appreciate her vulnerability and are excited about the prospect of seeing where your connection could lead. Five, she asks about your ideal type of girl. Listen up, fellas, because we're about to dive into one of the most telling signs that a woman is interested in being more than just your friend. When a lady starts probing you about your ideal type of girl, she's not just making idle conversation, she's gathering intel on what makes your heart skip a beat and seeing how she measures up to your dream woman. Think about it. When a woman asks you to describe your perfect partner, She's essentially saying, tell me what qualities you find most attractive in a potential girlfriend. I wanna know if I fit the bill. It's like she's handing you a compatibility questionnaire and eagerly awaiting your response to see if she makes the cut. So how do you respond when she starts fishing for your romantic preferences? Simple, you use it as an opportunity to highlight the qualities you admire in her without being too obvious. Say something like, you know, I've always been drawn to women who are passionate about their interests and have a great sense of humor. Kind of like how you light up when you talk about your volunteer work and always know how to make me laugh. By subtly drawing parallels between your ideal woman and the lady in front of you, you're sending a clear message that she embodies the qualities you find most attractive. You're showing her that she's not just another pretty face, but someone who truly captivates you on a deeper level. And here's the best part. Once you've painted a picture of your dream girl that suspiciously resembles the woman you're talking to, use it as a segue to ask her out. Say something like, it's funny. The more we talk, the more I realize how much you have in common with my ideal partner. I'd love to explore that connection further. Would you be interested in grabbing dinner with me sometime? She'll be thrilled to know that she fits your vision of the perfect woman and will likely jump at the chance to see if your compatibility extends beyond just conversation. Just remember, gents, when a woman starts asking about your type, it's not just curiosity. It's a sign that she's picturing herself in the role of your dream girl and wants to know if you see her that way too. Six. She hints at wanting to spend more time with you. Okay, gentlemen, it's time to talk about one of the most promising signs that a woman is interested in taking your friendship to the next level. When a lady starts dropping hints about wanting to spend more time with you, it's like she's waving a giant neon sign that says, I enjoy your company and want to explore a deeper connection. Now, these hints can come in many forms. Maybe she casually mentions how much fun she had the last time you hung out and how she'd love to do it again soon. Or perhaps she starts suggesting new activities or experiences that she thinks you'd both enjoy together. Whatever the specifics, the underlying message is clear. She's craving more quality time with you. So how do you respond when she starts hinting at wanting to see you more often? Simple. You take the bait and make a concrete plan to spend time together. Say something like, I've been having a blast hanging out with you too. Why don't we check out that new exhibit at the art museum this weekend? I think it would be right up your alley. By taking her hints and turning them into a specific invitation, you're showing her that you're not just picking up on her signals, but actively looking for ways to deepen your connection. You're demonstrating that you value her company and want to create more opportunities for meaningful interaction. And here's the kicker. Once you've made a plan to spend time together, use it as a chance to gauge her interest in something more romantic. During your outing, pay attention to her body language and the vibe between you. If the sparks are flying and the chemistry is undeniable, take a chance and express your interest in exploring a more intimate connection. Say something like, I have to say, every time we hang out, 
I find myself more and more drawn to you. Would you be open to seeing where this could go, beyond just friendship? By framing it as a natural progression of your growing connection, you're making it clear that you see her as more than just a buddy, without putting too much pressure on the situation. Remember, gents, when a woman starts hinting at wanting to spend more time with you, it's a clear sign that she's open to the idea of something more. It's up to you to take those hints and run with them, creating opportunities for your connection to blossom into something truly special. So now that you know when to make a move and ask her out, what's next for you? Discover how girls behave when they consider you a backup option, or learn the secrets to making women notice you. Thanks for watching. Please like, comment, and subscribe for more.